The Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations says we should be eating more insect protein to save the planet. No doubt there are energy, food, and shelter shortages across this globe. But for me, it's more of a choice than a mandate to eat insects. And I give Gabriel the cheetah the same choice. I woke him up. Uh, I was hoping he wasn't down here. He was, laying, he was just laying down. Look at his tired face. You see, look at that. That's a tired cheetah face there. Hello, hello. And it's always meet and greet with Gabriel first. Yeah, and always pleasure before business. That's it. So I'm waiting for Gabriel to settle down. There he goes. Good boy. Now I wait for him to settle down before my enrichment attempts. Uh, sit beside him. And uh, I got a little experiment with him. Yeah, buddy. There you go. And he's checking, say, what do you got? What are you doing for me? What are you doing? I got a little uh, surprise for Gabriel and for me. We're gonna we're gonna try to go green, Gabriel and I. We'll, we'll see. Uh, at yeah, the local uh, the shop here, local gift shop in Africa, South Africa. I got this here. These are what are these? Mapani worms. They're basically grubs. Not worms. This is the larval or caterpillar stage of this insect. If you didn't already know, I'm a huge fan of insect spiders and lesser organisms. I enjoy interacting and learning from all life. If it was from South Africa, that someone would cut his horn off. Kill him and cut his horn off, man. Look at that. I love bark. Tree bark. Uh, he must have just came out of his... Uh, Chrysalis, this uh, butterfly. Now I respect life, but I'm also an omnivore. But a traditional one, fruits, vegetables, and meats. Now I've tried the millworms before. They're a tasty treat for the meerkats. The Mapani worms caught my attention in the gift shop, and I was curious if Gabriel would eat it. The Mopani caterpillar is considered a delicacy and harvested in the southern African nations where it thrives. They get their name from the Mopani tree, where they're typically found. Once they've entered their pupil stage, they metamorphize into the beautiful emperor moth. So Gabriel and I are going to try to go green here and see if uh, we can eat um, insect protein. Uh, I'm going to try one. Let me try one. Yeah, buddy. Look what I got for you. So we're gonna to try to save the planet. Gabriel's is um, saving the planet his own way, in his own way by uh, he has bred before, hadn't, created any, hadn't produced any cubs, but he's helping the world too, increase his species. I, uh, I'm pretty used to everything in this world, but uh, what do you think, Gabriel? Let me see. Let's see if he likes it. Look, look, look. Apani, what do you think about that? You want to save the world by going green, eating some insects? Huh, buddy? Yeah, put. Put it down here for you. There you go, right there. So I don't think Gabriel's into it. It's dried protein too. They're not like uh There you go, buddy. I'm gonna try one, Gabriel. So Gabriel won't even try to save save the, the world by eating uh insects. I'm gonna try it and see if uh I'm gonna try it and see if I like it. Oh my I've had grub worms before. Um I'm not grub worms, what are they called? Wait, what, what do you think, buddy? What, what, what is it? Hey, here, look. He thinks I have food. It is food. Wait, you get all excited, buddy. Wait, you wanna try one? I'm gonna try one. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's like a rock. Oh my, it's a little salty Gabriel. Oh. No, I'm gonna like it, buddy. You wanna try it? Oh my gosh. Ugh. No, I'm going to stick to my beef and chicken and turkey. And Gabriel will stick with, with uh, zebra and eland and what else you eat, Gabriel? That's pretty bad, buddy. Oh, that's nasty. They salted it too much to preserve it. That's why I can't eat uh, preserved foods like that. Gabriel seems to now. I don't want that dinner table. He's gone. Ugh. No, I did eat one. I was swallowing it. You should prove that I'm eating it. Oh, my gosh. Uh, it's like a, a stale potato chip, you know, months old, but all conglomerated together. Oh, no, these are not for me. Gabriel didn't like it. Look at that. Well, I can't go this to waste, Gabriel. I'll give it to someone else. Maybe the mere cats will eat it. So think about uh, these cheetahs and Gabriel about, you know, eating that kind of thing. I've never known a, um, a larger predator eat bother with insects. There's too many they have to gather 
for energy purposes to survive off of it. Hold up. Searching the web, apparently rogue and prideless lions have been seen eating Mopani caterpillars during lean times. Even small mice, they don't, I don't see cheetahs chasing mice. Now Kimmy, hey you be purring Gabriel. Kimmy, uh, my cub, she um, <clears throat> ate a small mouse and enjoyed it. She's a, a trooper when it comes to food. This is really good. I can feed her almost anything, which is really good. Here. Hey buddy. I didn't like it. So it doesn't taste like, doesn't smell like meat or anything. He didn't like it. They have a, they go for larger animals. They're, you know, they're prey size, stomach size. Some get even larger, you know, to fulfill a uh, sensational appetite, you know, that, that keeps them living and, and uh, living on, you know. The, uh, the sensation and instinct of hunger is what keeps us all alive. Okay, right. Yeah, buddy, this didn't taste very good, buddy. You know, he's purring back. Just purr away. Good uh, little enrichment here for him. He's, uh, he's purring, his ears are forward, his eyes are wide open. What's going on? Even though Gabriel's purring, he quickly becomes annoyed by this experiment and grumbles away. What do you think, buddy? What do you think? What do you think, buddy? Hey, buddy. No, I'm not a fan of uh, mug pie. What do you call them? Mopani worms. Oh, I was getting upset now. Hear that? That's an annoyance. I may be bothering too much. See, I told you Gabriel's a wild animal. He needs lots of respect. So he didn't like this game I was playing anymore, so I'm gonna quit. It's okay, buddy. Yeah, it's okay, buddy. I really do. I give Gabriel a lot of respect. I just I keep a distance from him unless he comes to me. Um, and he's obviously got annoyed by Mopani, uh, Mopani worms didn't like him. No. Now he wants to rest, so I'll let him rest. Now I try enriching Gabriel's life. It's hard to read an animal's mind, and sometimes it doesn't work. He was disappointed by the treat and doesn't like things touching his paws. But I think he appreciates my efforts. If you like this video, please share it and give it a thumbs up. And consider joining my channel. Follow me.